Cancer diagnosis in Papua New Guinea is taking longer than expected. A shortage in pathologists is the main contributing factor. This concern was raised during PNG Air's Pinktober Cancer Information Session this morning in Port Moresby. Again, Mickey Kavera reports. Dr. Itaki is a trained pathologist, but there are not many like him. He says pathologists are as important as other medical professionals. However, they have been given little attention. Special pathology is a big problem we have in country. It takes uh, five years to train one specialist pathologist. Uh, at the moment, in my presentation, I mentioned, although we have about 13 to 14 specialists, only six are actively involved in cancer diagnostics. This shortage means longer diagnosis of diseases. Cancer is no different. And when we see the workload, we receive a lot of tissues around the country coming in. And lots of tissues for diagnosing cancer. And for a pathologist of six teams trying to do it, that's an enormous amount of workload. So the direct impact is that the results take longer. It requires an all-government approach to train more specialists. Dr. Itaki says it is a concern that must not be taken lightly. As a trainee pathologist uh, myself, um, I would like to see more pool of doctors coming in, increase interest, uh, but the government sponsors most of them, are uh, pays for their training fees. So if they have a limited budget, they say, no, we, we, we want to train only surgeons this time. We only want to train pediatricians because we have more babies dying. Uh, but, uh, and then pathology gets pushed down the bottom of the priority list. Mickey Cavera, NBC National News, Port Moresby.